For the first time in 70 years, Toro fans were unable to make their way up to Superga Hill on May the 4th to pay tribute to the Grande Torino team whose era of dominance was cut short by a tragic plane crash in 1949. However, it's a day of remembrance that lives in the heart of every football follower. That team and that day will forever be a symbol for those who love Toro. For those who work for this club and for all Italian sportsmen across the globe. Because we're talking about a side that represented the highest values of Italian and international sport with great dignity and great honour. running through his veins. He was born in 1976, the year Toro won their seventh and last Scudetto. A right back for the club in the 1990s, Longo's career has come full circle after taking over from Walter Mazzarri in February. Aside from the working opportunity, it's been a true question of the heart for me because I was raised with this shirt on since I was a kid. I played for Torino's youth sector since I was 10, and I was lucky enough to make my Serie A debut with the club. Then I came back to coach the youth teams, winning a youth league and a youth super cup. And now I get the chance to coach the first team. Torino means a whole lot to me, because it's always been like a faith for me, and today, I think of the club as family, because after so many years with these colours and all the ties I have here, Torino have become a very important part of my life. of Serie A brought Longo's short tenure at the helm to a temporary halt after only three games. To keep in touch with his new players, he has opted for a mix of smart tracking and team psychology. After consulting with my staff, we decided to draw up a tailor-made training program to perform at home for each player, and everyone accepted willingly. The players were extremely professional. Some had indoor bikes, some had treadmills, and some could run in their garden, some in their apartments. At the same time, we decided to train all together once a week, using an online platform. Trying to interact as much as possible, and trying to keep that dressing room spirit that we need in our sport. If you can get good relations and empathy going, you'll get a better job done. Resumes, the Granata will need to end the six game losing streak that has put them in a perilous position. A true Toro at heart, Longo cannot wait to face the challenge. Clearly, I miss football's adrenaline, the feeling it gives you, and having to manage all that positive stress. feel only straight before and after the game, depending if it went well or not. These are the emotions which keeps us alive, and by this point we're totally addicted. And when we can't feel them, we miss them terribly. <laughs> 